story overnight. Down trees and power outages in their wake. Anna Rivera joins us live now. That's right, John. I know those storms kept me up all night last night. You could just hear the thunder rolling through and many neighborhoods now are left to clean up this one in particular in Southern Wake County. Look at this house. Two massive oak trees falling right in the middle of this house and collapsing the ceiling. And we spoke to the homeowners who live in this house. They say they were sitting in the living room watching TV and in 15 within 15 minutes they decided, you know, we should probably get out of here when they heard those storms decided to go to their safe place in their home. And that is when those trees collapsed on their house. Now take a look at this video from Chopper 11. You can see just how massive this storm was downing and twisting so many trees and a lot of people affected by this, especially in Southern Wake County. We've seen Wilson County also affected by this. The schools there did have to cancel today because they did not have power. That's also the case right here in Wake County as well. Not schools canceling, of course, they're still in school, but they are without power today. Uh, this neighborhood right here in Southern Wake where we are Cedric uh, Drive, they actually have been without power for hours. Many of them saying that they're keeping their shades down. They're trying to keep their houses as cool as possible because Quaylen was talking about it. We're seeing some record high temperatures. So at last check, about 1700 people in Wake County still without power. Back to you guys.